freight trains are approaching the sand in there.
Letcher of Garden City, call in Hitchin and Letcher of Garden City only. When boarding, please allow passengers off the train first and mind the gap between the train and platform edge. Also, when boarding, please make use of all available doors and around the side of the road to the town. Everyone, gentlemen.
Second platform three, please thank you. Behind me on the right, once again. This is our train. We're heading to Grand Verma. Isn't that right? Yes. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is our first time going on this new Zima 800. These seats are so comfortable. Yeah, aren't they? It feels like, it feels like heaven. Uh... It does, doesn't it? Look, there are our seats that are reserved because we've got red lights on the reserved for us. These seats are so comfortable. I think this could be our first time passing Diggle's Way, like actually passing it. Our first time doing this. Here we are, we are leaving Stevenage on the LNER Azume 800 service. Oh my god, it's going really quick. It's a fitting celebration, isn't it? Whoa. I took off in like a second. But what I was going to say was that we are on the LNER service. This is new Azuma 800, that's now in service to York, but we're, but we're getting off at Grand Firm. So you're going to be seeing some trains at Grand Firm. Hopefully you're going to enjoy this. It's been feeling like a dream to go on this new Azuma 800. I've been really wanting to go on this one, and my dreams now come true. Yay! Hello, so we're getting off at Grand Firm, but this train, but the next, but the next stop for this train is Peterborough. We will call at Peterborough, Grand Firm, Newport, 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 do you mind? I'm trying to speak. Speak one more bloody time. Oh yeah, you, you, and you can have that way. Let's see. Oh, and then you have this to put your laptop on. The seats are very comfortable. This is basically LNER 2.0. This must be the best LNER I've ever done, making a brand new train in service actually incredible.
So this train's heading to York, we're getting off at Grantham, and the next station for this train is Peterborough. But we're getting off at Grantham. Yes, you heard me, Grantham. It's a place somewhere ages away. It will take us nearly hours to, to drive there. Because if, if, if we were driving to Grantham, it would take hours, wouldn't it? An hour and a half. It's an hour and a half, according, according to my dad. Passing Hitchin. We're now passing Hitchin like a lightning bolt. But we're going stupidly quick. We're going really jiggly right now. And we're going at 125 miles an hour. Oh, uh. First time passing Dibbles Wade, our first time ever passing Dibbles Wade. It's actually incredible. Is that another band of fun? Not what that was. But at any minute, we should be passing Dibbles Wade. Wait, no, 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 we're, we're passing it now. Now. How fast? Oh, Jesus. We're at full felt, mate. So this is not. Oh my gosh, this area looks new. This area, this area looks new. It's our first time passing Niggles Wade. Thank you very much. No, no, no. I'll take that as a yes then. Sandy now. There's comfortable seats. This thing for your laptop. And plug sockets. Yes, I don't know if you can see, but as you can see, yeah, right there, there are plug sockets. You should be approaching Saint Saint Neots. Oh, well, we're taking, well, we're taking a tinting service to uh, uh, Peterborough. Passing this cool factory. Maybe like a cream one. This looks really cool. So according to so according to Dad's phone. We're not, we didn't, we're not past Stevenage, but not, not past Sydney yet. We haven't passed it yet, but we're approaching it. Five, and four, that blue thing. Now. 
and, and like that we've now passed St. Neots. We've now passed St. Neots. The car park will look very busy. So we're not going at 125, we're going at 123 miles an hour, according to the internet. Going at 123 miles an hour around that. Should be arriving at Peterborough right now. And now arriving at Peterborough, I'm as well class 56 there. Thank you for travelling with MNER. I'm as well class 66 right there. Actually, we can go back to Stevenage. We have now arrived at Peterborough, I'm as a freight train. Right, we go back to Stevenage. So we'll okay. have to get an HST. Uh, we come here at night time before, Peter, aren't we? Yeah. Right, we'll have to get a HST back to Stevenage. Okay. You good with I that? think, yeah. I think the freight train should be leaving. Yeah, it's time to leave. And, then, and we're in a big city, Peter. Uh. Now leaving Peterborough. You know, we're now officially leaving Peterborough.
Let's keep on the crate. Oh, yeah, Grantham. It's a thin platform, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but sure. Here we are at Grantham. I don't even know how long we've been on this train for. There's loads of tracks here. They will talk funny, I think. The next station for this train is Doncaster. Um, because like this train's heading to York. Right. This amazing LNER Azuma 800 uh, is actually incredible. I think this this one's stopping. Uh.
Yeah, I think this one's stopping. It's going a bit fast though. So the second, so right now guys, the second when our train left, the second when our train left, our train was, was an Azuma one, another Azuma comes in. Uh, legit though, there was one like that that just left, and then another one arrives. Uh, why are its brakes, why are its brakes so squeaky? Metal, metal does. So this one is heading to London's King's Cross. The next station for this train is Stevenage at 12.18. So I think we got some... I... So right here we got a class 150... We got a 158 made by East Midlands. I don't know... And I don't know where this came from. I absolutely do not know where this came from. That's what I said. I absolutely don't... I absolutely do not know where this came from. Uh, like this, and, and there goes this and <laughs> this LNER service to London Skeens Cross. The next station for the LNER train is Stevenage. And there it goes. Uh. So it turns out this train. It turns out that like this train might be terminating. To, it might be terminating this station, this train, because this train is heading to Skegness. Now, if you don't. Now, if you don't know what Skegness is, Skegness, Ness. Is, Skegness is a massive seaside place all the way across the country. Full of poor people. I've been there on holiday. It's not very pleasant. But there is a beach. Rude. There is a beach, though. Yeah, but you said it's full of poor, 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 poor people. <laughs> Show some respect. <laughs> Show some respect. <laughs>
Oh. My. God. <laughs> it looks really bad. It's a little bit wet, isn't it, Sam? Yeah. Starting to... Oh, really? Yeah, that's another East... That's another East Midlands train right there. Bloody hell! Rain, calm! Um, no. God, rain, calm down! This rain is out! Right now, man. Guys, as you can see, this rain is completely out of control. Isn't it? Yeah. This rain is right now out of control. Passing by, we've got a LNI just. Got an LNI just here. We saw that earlier going past Stevenage to London. So we are now here at Starbucks just to get a hot chocolate. It's like a warm up bodies up because my body. Look at the price of it in here. What do you mean? You swear mummy shops. Um, no, we, we go here some. We come here sometimes. Like when I was on holiday, like when we were on holiday, I I had Starbucks twenty four seven. Two pounds, Jesus! Is that croissant? That croissant? Okay, arriving. We've got an HST. I don't, I don't know where it's from, but this one, well, I do know that it's heading to London's Keen's Cross. And me and Dad have to wait an hour for our one, because if we went on this one, it would cost 70 billion pounds. Not happening. And there is a Grand Central service, and the, and the Grand Central service arriving. London's Keen's Cross to Sunderland, I think. Believe me now, is this LNER service? to London's King Cross. Here from Edinburgh up to London Skeens Cross. This train is from Edinburgh. Edinburgh. Arriving now is a LNER service. So arriving now is an LNER service from London Skeens Cross to Leeds. My here passing now is the LNR server from London Schemes Cross to Leeds. Passing now, uh, arriving now is a LNR service to London Schemes Cross. And this one is, and I, I, uh, I, and this one is, and this one is, and this one is Le this one to London Skeens Cross, this is Leeds to London Skeens Cross. Then we've got another one that's arriving soon from London Skeens Cross to Newark Northgate. To Newark Northgate, I'm assuming. Yeah. So, alright, so the one that's just arrived now is, is Leeds to London Skeens Cross. Then we've got another one arriving from London Skeens Cross to Newark Northgate. Leaving now is your leaving now is on class 91 LNER service from Leeds to London Skeens Cross. Next station, next station, next station for the class 91 is that it's, it's Stevenage. So the, the class 91 is calling at Stevenage and London Skeens Cross. And then the HST 
and then the HST that has arrived, that one's calling out Newark North, that one's calling out Newark Northgate only. Leaving now is your LNER service to Newark and Northgate, calling out Newark and Northgate only. Which was leaving now is your HST LNER service to Newark and Northgate, calling out Newark and North, calling out Newark and Northgate only. So this is a East London's train, sir. This to not to Nottingham. What is it? Nottingham. Nottingham. So this train's heading to Nottingham. I don't know where that is. Is that, is that I think that's like across the country. That's why I was last week at work. Okay, we got a service. So we got a service to lead. I just came in like a lightning bolt. The brakes now smell like old diesel because the driver came. This one right here, the driver for this train came in way too quick. Didn't he? Yeah, he had to slam on the emergency brakes. They're burning. Wait, a minute. so he came in that fast, he had to use the emergency brakes. I think so, because he was absolutely screaming and smelling. Oh, Do you think he should get a fine? No, I just don't think he cares. He came in way too booming quick. Yeah. That was absolutely crazy. He came in way too quick. Just wow. Because this one just came in here way too booming quick. Had to legit slam on the brakes. You had to like. You even had to press the emergency brake, it was going that quick. So, this train is now leaving. I don't even even think the brakes might work now. Because he had to like legit slam on them so hard because he was going way too quick. And he was going, fun fact, he was going, he was going that quick, he had to use the emergency brakes. Here goes the LNER service to Leeds. Leaving now your East Bend train service to Nottingham to Nottingham.
Yeah. Coming in now is our is me and Dad's train from Valentine's Cross. We're getting off at Stevenage. I think this is. I think this one is Newark Northgate to London Queen's Cross. I think this one is Newark Northgate to London to London Queen's Cross. All right, let's let's go. So this is our. I think it's our like eighth time on a Virgin train. So I think this is like my eighth time on the Virgin train, and this is and this is my second time going on, and this is my second time going on an HST. Speaking of which. This, the HST was the first ever Virgin train I went on. Uh, this HST right here, the HST was the first train I ever went on. No, 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 the first Virgin train. Uh, no, sorry. Here we are. We're leaving Grantham. Uh, we're heading to Stevenage. Wow. You can open the windows for these trains. Uh, you can like, get some amazing fresh air in. Uh, mm -hmm. Feels nice. Here we are. Well, here we are. We're now leaving Grantham. Oh, look at that cool, ch that cool church. Look at that. Well, right, should we go sit down? You can. I might look out the window more. So I think we are going to be passing Peterborough because it wasn't. I don't think this is called. I don't think this is stopping at Peterborough. Stopping at Peterborough and Stevenage, I think. I don't know. Right. Yeah, Peterborough. Oh, so this train's calling out Peterborough, Stevenage, and London Stevenage Cross. Yep. After two two hours of waiting, we're now back. We're now on our train to Stevenage. I think it's like my eighth time on this on these trains. It's jiggling, it's jiggling like crazy right now. We're slowing down, so we shouldn't be heading to Peterborough. Because we're going to pass the city. There's another class city sick. There's, there's free trains all around Peterborough, isn't it? Isn't it? Oh, yes. Yeah, like loads. Like, there's loads of freight trains running at midnight. Ouch. Yeah, we should be. We should be. 
I wish I had a good point. That's a such a lot right there. It has a, it has a digger around it. Well, we have now arrived at Peterborough. I think it's starting to rain. Uh. You gotta get a seat Yeah. So yeah, we've now arrived at Peterborough. So it's starting to rain. We are now leaving Peterborough. Now we're heading off to Stevenage. Mad, mad, the city of Peterborough. Because Peterborough is really big. But there we go, we're now leaving. Still haven't approached hunting. We've been on it for that long. So right now we haven't even approached hunting hunting them yet. I think we're like halfway there of approaching there. I don't know. We've now passed Huntingdon. We've still got like a few more stations up until. Faster, I think. So right now we are going at 120. Mm. Wait, what the hell? Uh, the GPS is messing out. Once it gets level, there you go. That'd be right. We're going at 122 miles an hour. It's already free. No, nah, 120. Yeah, we're, at, we're going at 123 miles an hour. Like the speed limit is 125. And like, if if this train, if the driver was going at like was going over the speed limit, he'd, he'd get fine. He would get a fine if he, were, if he was really? going over the speed limit. Would really? he? Yeah. Might do. Yeah, he would. If he was going at 180 miles now, he would get a big fine. So we, we have now passed St. Neots. We have now passed St. Neots. This has been a really long day. Yeah. But. It may be going fast, but I don't think it's going over, like over the speed limit. No, they just set it to a program, they? Yeah. Like I mean, they just program it in their cabin. Yeah, and like we are going, like we are going fast, but not like going that fast, like going over the speed limit of 125 miles an hour, because we're right now going at 123. They set it in their cabin. The guy said, didn't they? They just press a button. They gotta hold something down or something. I still can't get over that one trainer like that stopped their grand film. No, <laughs> with the the brakes. Yeah, yeah. He sounded yes, he was coming in that fast, he had to use the emergency brakes. He was going that he was going that fast that he had to use the emergency brakes. He was going that quick. But over here taking a Team Zig service trainer. Yeah. You've now passed Sandy. We should eventually be approaching the area of where I live, Biggleswade. We should right now be passing Biggleswade right any minute, right now, by now. You should eventually be passing Douglas Wade because we just passed Sandy, so you should be passing Douglas Wade. We're just on this really long straight line thingy. Because there's a long straight where trains need to go past Douglas Wade. I think that's what we're on. Should be passing right now. Yep. He's out past Bibbles Wade. He's out past Bibbles Wade. And we're now passing Aldley. Just past it. Flyover is right there. I mean, if the flyover is there, it's that taking you should. Kitchen, isn't it? Yeah, that's yeah. a flyover for Yeah, we should, yeah. So it means we should be approaching Hitchin. 
We should be approaching Hitchin right now. Oh god. We should be passing right now. Yep, we've now passed it, Jen. Just one station left until we can get off oh, at Stevenage. This is this must have been this must have been a really long train vlog, you think? Mm. I don't even know how long it's going to be. Still low. Nearly out. Oh, we overtook this train. I, I don't know where. I, don't, I, I have no clue where that one was heading to. I have no clue where that was heading to. Yeah, we're starting to slow down. So we are starting to slow down, so we should be heading up, heading to Stevenage any minute by now. Okay, we're starting to slow down, meaning that we're getting close to Stevenage. There's a class of 100 back there. I can't really show you it. Now we're at Stevenage. Back there, there's a class of 100. I can't really show you. But yep, yeah, we have now arrived at Stevenage. Stop again. Right. So, we've now arrived at Stevenage. Okay, wait, I, I think I might need like, to move. Like, and it, it, and, yeah! it should be locked. And there's that class of 100 that we, uh, that we overtook earlier. Leaving, leaving for this, leaving this one. Leaving right now, and this one is a team league service to Brighton via London St. Francis. International formed of 12 coaches, which is the train that we overtook earlier. Leaving right here is our, is our train that's now leaving from Newark and Northgate to London's Keynes Cross, calling out London's Keynes Cross only. And there it go, and there it goes. Time for me we're going. To go shop. We're going to have to wait, and so we're going to have to wait an hour because our train to Peterborough got cancelled due to, and that's due to a broken down train. Uh, coming in right now. I'm not sure I believe them though. Coming in right. Coming oh, in right. Believe them. You look at it. Peterborough's cancelled, and then the Cambridge ones. Rally now is your 15. Is your two minute delayed service to Cambridge from London's Kings Cross to Cambridge? I'm assuming. This train terminates. <sighs> Looks like we're turn, look at, yeah, we're gonna have to wait another hour because our train to Peterborough got cancelled and it's due to a broken down train. Uh, I hope this broken down train didn't break down in the middle of a crossover as well. Well, that stopped the whole of the network, didn't it? Wait, a yeah. Months ago. Yeah. In case you had not know, I, I, I even made a video about it, I had, like, split, I had to split it up into two parts. So what happened was, is that a train, is that a train broke down in the middle of a crossover and there's an HST. So what happened was, a virgin train broke down in the middle of a crossover, it stopped, it, it stopped the whole f***ing line. It broke down in the middle of a crossover, it stopped the whole line. But it, it legit, it legit stopped. The entire line, loads of trains were getting cancelled, and, they, and they, had, they had to replace loads of them with taxis until when they got the, tra the train moving. But then, the, but then there was another broken down train at Wollongong City, and then there was a trespasser. And then that trespasser was the trespasser on board that broken down train because he got the amp, and he's, he's now gonna have to get a, a thousand pound fine. Fine, we were legit stuck on platform two at Hitch for five hours straight. And like you were at a breaking point, weren't you? Well, it was quite a challenging day. 
But we managed to survive and, and not ways. die. I'll now look for the next train. I mean, at this way, we be, we be, like, relieved that we're going back to Biggleswade. But no, hell no, we can't. Because, like, because the Peterborough train's cancelled, that, that's due to a broken down, a broken down train. And you, you never know, we, we, might, we, we, we might even pass a broken down train. How much battery you got, mate? We could, we could pass a broken down train. Yep, we're now arriving at Hitchin. Man. So like, I think they're not lying. Dad thinks that they're talking bullshit. Oh, it's only at London Blackfriars at the moment and it's eight minutes late. This, is, this is the what is? The, in, the train they are running now. Peterborough, are no? Yeah, it's at London Blackfriars. It's running eight minutes late. I mean, London Blackfriars? It's got all the way come, yeah, it's, it's got to come from South London to here. South London? Oh gosh, I, th I, think, I think this broken down train might have they broke down in, in the middle of a crossover. Because the last time that happened, it blocked, it stopped the whole line. Uh, gosh, they went. That was when they had a bad day. Uh, right. That big airport by train. You can take that by taking the class seven hundred. But but trains like I go to Horsham. But trains like go to Horsham. Go and take that to get the, to get the Gatwick airport. Are you yeah. Enough? Yeah. Your video is going to be a little bit too long now, but you can leave it now. Well, it's going to be, it might be an extra hour long because of this damn broken down no train. No one's got an hour in their lives to watch it, darling. Yeah. We're leaving now, is your delayed, is your delayed sensing service to, Cam to Cambridge. All of eight coaches. What? It's funny how they just realised the yeah. track circuit very well. I just realised it's broken. <laughs> it's been broken for two hours. Passing now is a Great Northern, a Great Northern service from Cambridge, from Kingsland, the Lions Kings got across.
still at the platform, mate. You have done well, yeah? The second one now. But in Tallas, the first one was when we got to the station at 10 past, but now it counts with the 1550 as well. Don't ruin this day for me, it's been hard enough.
Sainz and Mitch Dupont. Nothing is done this time. Yeah, I think that's gone all the way down to South London. Really? I wonder where, I wonder where they parked them up. So after about three hours of waiting, well, how long was it? Uh, it's either a signal fault or a train broke down. There's lots of different stories. Basically, they, no one really knows. No, how, how long was the wait? Uh, another hour and ten minutes. After an hour and ten minutes of waiting, look what the hell finally arrives. Uh. Okay. Arriving now is our foot service that finally arrived. It is a it's our service to Peterborough that finally arrived. It took long enough. <coughs> Sorry about that, sort of was. Well, this service is going to be busy, so I can't video. Oh, wait for that one. So that train told that red signal, and I don't, I don't know why it's had that red signal. There it is.